Welcome back. Calling All Veterans Project Opportunity, as we were saying before the break, is a program that can help you get a business venture veteran, get it up and running. It's broken down into doable steps, and there are people and resources to help you along the way, including my guest, who is the founder of Project Opportunity, Mr. Joe Giordano. Good morning. Welcome. Good morning. Thank, Thank you, you for, for being me with again. us. Um, we were talking a little bit about the program and expectations. Um, and how you you know pretty much let people help them to is this business going to work is this a good idea what are the things you need to get this business up and running um how long five years and about now you were saying close to a hundred people have we had gone. 96 people complete the program we have a graduation rate of 85 percent statewide and so tell me maybe a success story, um, someone who you still keep in touch with and they're like grateful that they went through the class because either the business is working or because they realized it wasn't a good idea. We have a, we have a, a lot of success stories um, here on the Eastern Shore. The types of ventures that have got up and running include a private investigator, a dog breeder, an athletic apparel company. Hmm an assisted living facility, a landscaping company, a moving company, wow. an interior design, an income tax service, okay. a veteran franchising consultant, an IT consulting business, and a website design. So, so those are local success stories that we've had. That is awesome. Yes. I mean, that's list and it's so varied. Yes. So people really do bring in all kinds of ideas. Yeah, and we do that when we go through the assessments. We try to have diversity in the class. I don't want four website designers okay. in the class because you're sitting across the table from your competition. You're mm -hmm. not going to be honest in your discussions mm -hmm. and your evaluations. Mm -hmm. So we try to make the participants be a, as diversified as we can. It makes for better, more honest discussion in the classroom. Okay, so I'm a veteran. I want to, I have this idea. I've been working on it, trying to develop it for over a year. I'm coming to the next session. What do I need to bring with me? You need to bring a solid idea of a business plan. You need to make a commitment to come to class every week. It's a 10 week program. Ten weeks, okay. We meet one night a week for three hours and you have to have the time in between classes, between homework, reading assignments and research, you're looking at 25 to 30 hours a week. It's just like taking a, a course. Co college yeah. course. And what is the cost to me to participate in the class? There is absolutely no cost to any veteran. No cost. It's been free since day one. It will remain free since day one ever. All the right. only cost is the time and effort that you put into your business plan. And d I, this is, it may not sound like a big thing, but you even serve dinner, don't you? Sometimes we serve dinner. Um, we do honor them at the end with a graduation ceremony. Nice. We have a catered. We have a catered meal for them and yes, their family and, and guests. Yes, that's what Okay. Um, so through the, through the 10 weeks, you meet one night a week for three hours. Yes. And the veteran needs to be have the time to commit to that, obviously, because then there are, like you said, reading assignments and homework. And you provide all of that, yes. all of the materials that they need. Yes, we use the Next okay. Level Curriculum, which is a nationally recognized entrepreneurship training program and they do get a certificate of completion at the end and we have an outstanding cast of subject matter experts who come in every week we have um, commercial insurance agents we have lawyer we have CPA we have marketing experts we have uh, commercial bankers who come in okay. um, talk all about what you need to do to be up and running we have two individual review sessions of your business plan. We have experts sit down and spend 20 minutes looking at your marketing plan and giving you feedback, and then later on looking at your financials and giving you feedback. Okay, when is the next session? Uh, the orientation sessions uh, is gonna be August 12th in Easton okay. at six o'clock, and August 19th in Salisbury at six o'clock. Okay. And uh, I would like to say that this year, the National Guard Army here in Salisbury has donated a classroom that we can use not only for the orientation, but for the classes. We split the classes, five in Easton and five in Salisbury because we serve the whole Eastern Shore and I try to cut down the commute for everybody. Okay, so you'll spend, if you're, you, you'll spend half your time in, in both, yes, both sections. In both so locations. you need to be able to accommodate that need, as well. Need that travel. Um, Joe, as we, as we get ready to wrap up here, um, how, 
How rewarding has it been for you? I mean, you were a veteran who you said sometimes the resources, it was difficult for you to, yes. to find a job. How rewarding has it been to be able to now make that transition a little easier for um, people not unlike it's, yourself? It's, it's uh, probably one of the great pleasures of my life. Um, these veterans deserve this opportunity. They've sacrificed a lot. Their families have sacrificed a lot. And not only does it make them an easier transition back to the civilian workforce, but every person that has completed my program has told me that when I get my business up and running and need to hire people, I'm hiring veterans first. Okay. So there will be a, a trickle down effect uh, to help the high rate of unemployment among veterans in the region. What is a website that um, people can go to if they want to hear, see this information again and maybe kind of just have it in front of them to think if the class is starting up or, or, or for them? Sure, it's uh, www.project-opportunity.com or they can call me at 410-860-6664. All right, Project Opportunity. And the next classes are just about here. So is there a registration deadline? We obviously call pretty soon because we are here. No, as long as you can make it to the orientation, um, it is a selection process and we do, we do a, a pretty thorough assessment, but the first step is to make the orientation session and then go from there. All right, so if this speaks to you and some of the dish is issues that you've been faced with, please, Give Joe a call, go to the website, Project Opportunity. Thank you so much for sharing with us this morning. It's just been a great insight and a wonderful way to see how you are helping the veterans in our community. So well, thank, thank you, you for having me on again. I appreciate it. All right. Well, thank you for watching Good Things Delmarva. If you have good things you'd like to share, email me at lanita underscore wesson at wmbt.com. And remember to catch us here every Sunday morning. Have a beautiful and purpose-filled day, and we will see you next week.